Hello, it's Equine Dreamer here again. So once again, we are playing Star Stable. Um, and I have a tad bit to complain about again. Um, yeah, so I noticed that one of the races where you have to find Justin or whatever, Josh's horse, um, the Dark Core thing, the Red Druid, I passed those and I passed the Witch. Yay! Um, I found out that Justin is truly evil and the race was damn hard. It took me several tries, but it was really hard. Anywho, um, now I'm talking to Alex here. This is what she is saying. I'm gonna flip the camera over so I have to end the video. You're back. Tell me about your adventure. Justin Moreland updated. So we got him again. Uh, oh yeah, it's Justin Moreland. Anyhow, uh, we got him in our books again. What? Uh, what an adventure you've had. I'm impressed by your heroic, uh, heroics and Guardian Knight's bravery. So Mr. Saunders and the two of his dark riders live out there on an oil rig, which which serves as a secret dark core um, headquarters. You're saying that Justin uh, that Justin made it clear that he didn't want to come back with you by me, uh, but maybe he had no choice. What have we learned from this? Okay, so we give Alexis an update. Okay, so we have to talk to her again. Okay, so it's green here. Uh, that's true. We've continued. We confirm that Dark Core somehow is responsible for Lisa Ann's disappearance. Lisa and Ann's uh, and Ann's disappearance. We know they want to stop us from gathering four Soul Riders. We also know that they're trying to get four Dark Riders, uh, and they're in a hurry. And Justin is one of the four now. We need to wrap our heads around this one. Our next step must be planned out well. So it looks like, looks to me that Justin Moreland went evil and he didn't want to come back with us. We need to discuss this with Fripp and the other druids. I'll get Linda. You you inform you inform Elizabeth in Fittedale and me, uh, meeting can get started as soon as possible. So, yeah, so now we have, just have to go to Elizabeth. I hope this is not a race. Okay, good. Thank God it's not another race. I just don't like the quests that finish off with a race. I'm still stuck on the Dundle race. Um, so this is where this quest ends um, for now. All right, so now we're back at the Druids. Now we're back at this druid thing, this druid area, this beautiful druid area. The secret place of the Keepers of Everden. So we're going to see this probably multiple times. But can I just say Fripp? The squirrel looks really cute. Okay, so together again, the druids and the soul riders. Troubled times call for desperate measures. We have been informed of, uh, of the news Alexis has brought forward from her breakneck adventure, and here are the quite a few issues that are uh, that careful consideration. I think it was quite reckless to bring such a strong Ardeen's life in uh, Ardeen's light to Scarecrow Hill, uh, and anything could have happened. The Shadow Witches could easily have captured Alexis and devoured her soul and the reign of the shadows. Don't be silly. The fact that Alexis possesses so much power is the fact is in fact a blessing. Your bickering is making my ears hurt. Elizabeth, she had choices to find an apple and we knew this she uh, and she succeeded. It's disc it's describable that the power that Alexis possesses could, should also be controlled. We must patronize her training. 
Right now, however, we have an important matters to discuss. Let's review the facts in more time. Please give us a summary. Sure, sure, Fred. We know that we know that Justin is one of Dark Horse headquarters, and has been built with some kind of oil rig southwest of Yorvik. Alex has overheard the discussion before uh, between Mr. Sands and two Dark Rider riders, Justin. They are saying that they had fooled out Justin's horse, which uh, as now has been supposed to become a dark rider horse for Justin in fact. So Justin is a dark rider now? Yes, we think so. Maybe not fully fig on the member yet, but he has not against his will. Uh, it was not against his will. He did not want to be rescued Alex by Alexis. We don't know if he felt pressure to say that only that, so that Alexis would not get caught. Alexis heard rumors that Mr. Sand manipulated Justin's memories and we're not sure. Uh, it's Justin's own choice to be a dark rider. Okay, so um, all hope for Justin is not lost. Maybe not. I'll continue before Alexis was forced to run away and head over the heels. Um, I heard them saying must must before uh, must before dark riders, and that they are missing um, one to be able to do the needs to be done, and whatever it it is, it's not to be done. It's it's to be done before the soul riders beat them to it but the dark core wants to accomplish with four dark riders before things get into such uh, no idea what it is Alexis has already figured it out yes Alexis has come Durable conclusion that Dark Core is going to try to speed up their efforts to summon Garnock. What? <laughs> Garnock? Um, assisted by their Dark Riders. That's impossible. Unfortunately, it may be very possible. Our soul Riders' primary duty is to, fi to fight Garnock. And you can be that, mm, you can be sure that the Dark Riders opposite is the very way our soul riders must have connection to Garna. Dark core secret agenda has always been strength uh, to strengthen Garnock and control the power of, in the world. We know that it's quite some time. There is nothing that indicates no longer true. It it's also likely for us to take a chance and, and is no longer our plan. It definitely explains Mr. Sands is back again and some, uh, uh, as he is somewhat of an expert in the area. Hmm. He must have come up with something new to have come back to Jorvik again, especially after it happened last time giggles. The Lost Light Ceremony Book Mr. Sands has found the Lost Light Ceremony Book. That book describes how soul riders perform the Dark Light Ceremony to stop Garnock. Oh no, I think you're right. Linda, uh, Linda, do you think Mr. Sands has found the book? In, in that case, he and his Dark Riders run the ceremony backwards and make Garnock stronger. Shit, that doesn't sound good. If this is the case, then he has all the need to tear it down and fragile walls to keep Garnock beyond the horizon of our reality. Goodness gracious, let, let the Ardenian light between us everything lost if Mr. Sand succeeds. Um, we don't know if it's, it's, it's bad yet. That's right, let's hope we've, we've got it all wrong. But friends, but friends, we cannot assume that we're in the wrong and must act accordingly. We need
need to act, but we need to gather our soul riders and still don't have good la good leads on locating Lisa and Anne. The information collected by Alexis confirms that Dark Core really is behind the disappearance and we can find out more information. We also need we also need to get started on training Alexis so she can be a real soul rider who knows we're going to find Anne and we need to alternate plans, please. Uh, what more should we be doing right now? Is there anything we can do to interfere Dark Core even more? I think maybe we should plan another visit to Dark Core. They must slow. They must be a little slower than the uh, as they are one dark rider and at least one core short. Just imagine if we could get Justin out or if we could find the Lost Light ceremony book that Mr. Sands has in his possession. It goes out saying uh, back there is a huge risk to take but it may be worth and be able to uh, important information. Let's finish the meeting now so we can do some more planning. We have gained some until we find a new horse for Justin. Well, may find a new horse for Justin. Elizabeth, you are responsible in making sure that Alexis gets as much training as possible before we decide the next course of action. See you again soon. Go in peace, Druid and Soul Riders. Okay. There is a... Okay. There is a lot to discuss. Well, we a lot more now than we did before. Thank you. Uh, we are short of time there because consistent threat of dark, uh, dark sheep of Garnock. But our next move is needed as planned... Uh, needs to go needs to be planned well okay so the meeting is complete so we finally did that so we we're in a special meeting oh my god oh there's another rider wicked ponies clan i bet you she wants to be my friend i have no time for that <laughs> okay we will move on the next step we uh when we're ready we we ne now we need to plan and prepare our next step produce the result uh, we want. If the situation is bad as we think, then one wrong move and Dark Core may succeed their evil plan. Okay, well, listen to Elizabeth. Now, now we have to listen to her again. How much times do we have to do this? Anywho, when we are ready. Okay. Fripp thinks we should be uh, be getting ready for the new expedition, uh, expedition, Dark Horse headquarters to find out more of their plans. I will contact you when we're ready to go on. Okay, I think that's it. And then the heart thing. Uh, Alexis, come back when uh, with me. Reputation for Vividales has increased. Okay. So there's 